For me, being part of Gresham College would be about being part of a community who thought that engagement with the public on, on big questions of science, art, religion, everything, really, really matters. It also, I hope, will cross-fertilize. Actually, in talking to my colleagues, I'll have a deeper vision of the questions I'm engaging. But I think, for, in many ways, the, the thing that really excites me about Gresham College and my colleagues is this sense of serving a really important public whose needs aren't really being met in many other ways. I think for me one of the most exciting things about the series that's about to happen is that I'll be talking to an audience in the city of London, and that's, that's really exciting. These are real people. There's not sort of academic audience. There's an engaged, intelligent audience who are thinking about questions because they really matter. And for me, that, that's really important. And of course, it's great fun to talk to people who think things are interesting, because if they think they're interesting, it makes me perform better as a lecturer. One of the things I've noticed is that there are many people who have taken early retirement, who have postponed thinking about really deep questions because they've been in very busy jobs, and suddenly find they have space to think about these things. They're intelligent, engaged people, and they're looking for food for their minds. For me, Gresham does that. It, in effect, puts on very good lectures by very good people, but it's the audiences, the people who come because they want to think about these things. For me, that's something really important that Gresham does, and that audience, that very intelligent, engaged, committed audience, is one of the great delights of Gresham College.